Hey everyone, it's Lisa from Primitive Gatherings and it's time to unbox our Quilt Box subscription. Now this is our second year of quilt boxes, so this will only be box number seven that we have done. So let's take a look to see what's all in the box. First off, you're gonna see a letter telling you everything that's in your box. Now, a lot of the projects in here might need a background or might need a little something extra or binding that we might not be able to include because we are on a strict budget. This box is $45 and that includes shipping. So we try to jam pack it with as many projects as we can. And sometimes that means leaving out a background. So you can provide your own and make your quilt how you want it, not so it's like everyone else's. So it's super fun to see the different quilts. Now this, box contains an ongoing project that you will just get a pieces and parts for each box and then a lot a couple other uh, projects and fun things to do. Now you will be getting this cute cross stitch pattern. Katie is back again for another six boxes to complete a whole year's worth of these cross stitches. If you weren't in the first year of the quilt box you can go back and get the other patterns for these. They are for sale on our website. But this is the one for February. Super cute. And then we have the ongoing project, which I do not have because all it is is a bunch of triangles for this month. So I'm not gonna show you anything for this month. But you get this packet of fabrics and you are gonna pick your background for this one. And we've picked a really nice tan. You can kind of see it here in the photo. Just a very nice neutral that goes with all of the fabrics in the quilt. And there they all are. Super fun, very scrappy. Bright Spot is a pattern and a mini charm and it makes an 18 by 18 quilt. And that is right here. How fun is this? And then I believe this is a cute little charm pack pattern called Jelly Sticks. And it is by Corey Yoder. And again, I think you might have to add the little bit of a background in there to finish that up. But how fun is that? Nice and springy, just in time for the daffodils to bloom. I could see a nice little bouquet of daffodils on the cover with that underneath it. Here's the pattern for Katie's cross stitch. And there's that. You have a tube of 12 binding needles. Now, if you've never used these, you're in for a treat because they are, there's just something about them. They don't bend. You can thread them very nicely and they're just super joy to stitch with. Try them and you let us know how you like them. So this last little notion in here is a tool for you to keep your binding on when you know, you're know you done with your quilt, you've got it off to the quilter, but where did you put the binding? So here, I had, had our guy put a hole in here so we can hang this on the hanger that's with our quilt as well. So you can kind of keep that right with that. So this will be able to wrap up to a king size binding on there. Super fun, right? And just a FYI, it doesn't come with the binding on here. We just have this on here so you can see how to wrap that on there for a visual. All right. Okay, so that's it for our quilt subscription box, which ships all even months. So that would be, you know, February, April, June. So I hope you've enjoyed this subscription box. If you would love to join us, go to our website under Blocks of the Months, Clubs, and our subscriptions are housed there. And I hope you can get in because spots are limited. Take care, everyone, and see you next box.